So if you have a 3D site already and you want to put it into Revit, I'll show you how to do that in three minutes. So let's go ahead and open up our topography drawing in AutoCAD. And so if you're following along with my CAD Mapper tutorial, link it up here. Uh, CAD Mapper exports all of these components and the topography is exported as a mesh. We can go ahead and select our 3D mesh, but you'll notice if you if you zoom in, like a lot of these points come to kind of sharp edges, and the problem with that is that's going to generate sort of like that in Revit. It's just not going to look as clean as we want it to. We want to clean up the file a little bit so it's not so rough. And so how we do that, it's real simple. In AutoCAD, we're going to select our mesh. We're going to do smooth more. And so what that does is literally it smooths out all of those sharp vertices into kind of a cleaner surface. And so go ahead and hit explode. And then what we want to do is take that exploded mesh and we'll just save this as two. And so let's go back to Revit. We'll start a new template, architectural template project. I like to go and start with a default 3D view. So you can do import CAD. Since we've already separated out all of our drawings, we have topography on its own individual drawing. Let's select topography number two here, and then go ahead and go back into massing and site, topo surface, create from import, and select that topography. We only want topography selected. Hit OK. That's fine. Hit the check. And now we can select both and then just deselect one, unpin to delete. All right, cool. So we've got our topo surface. That's done. Easy enough. So that's basically it for this tutorial. If you guys thought it was helpful, you know, give me a thumbs up, subscribe and all that good stuff. Uh, but really let me know in the comments below if there's anything specific that you wanna know about AutoCAD or Revit. I really appreciate you guys watching this and I wanna keep making tutorial videos. So just let me know what you guys are into and I'll be happy to do it. So let's keep this momentum rolling and I'll catch you in the next one.